Hey everybody, the Bongus here, ready to give you a brand new Let's Play! Super Smash Brothers for the Nintendo 64, and yes, this is brought to you by GameAnyone.com. Now, when I first heard about this game as a preteen, I thought it was going to be quite weird, but also quite interesting. I mean, it's a Nintendo brand fighting game that takes so many different characters in the Mario or Nintendo universe, hits them against each other. I mean, this game really started a good series that has been on the GameCube and the Wii as well. And some possible, possible future releases on other consoles. Or other handhelds. So yeah, I definitely wanted to share this with all of you guys. Well, it was in a poll which beat Final Fantasy V Advance, believe it or not. So, anyways, we are gonna get this started, shall we? Oh yeah, and I'll do a run as each character and do the bonuses too. I think that intro enough just wants to get you in the ass-kicking mood. I don't want to go through the tutorial. I already know how to play this. Uh, let's see. You can go through training mode. You can practice the old bonuses that you'll come across in the main mode anyway. So let's go do this. Uh, for now, we're going to go with very easy. But don't worry. With each character, I'll just adjust the difficulty. Maybe up to normal or maybe even hard. Let me start with Yoshi. I don't want to be red. I want to be... Actually, I'd rather be like Rocky Green. Alright, let's go. My first opponent is Link. Okay, to learn how to play, basically A is your standard attack. Just tap forward and then hit A to do a smash. B is one of your moves. Up and B is another move. Down and B is your third special move. In Melee and, and Beyond, including Brawl, you get like a fourth special move. Let's see. Z is the shield. R is my throw. Or you can hold Z and press A to do a throw. That works too. The real objective is to try to knock your opponent off the arena or through the border. Wow, that was a very fucked up intro. Three, two, one, but we're still in the game. Time to beat up my own brethren. I got it. It's an 18 on 1, but at least the opponents are much weaker compared to if you fought a regular Yoshi by itself. Just use whatever move you want you think is going to do a lot of damage. as a weapon. Okay, it's a flower. I want it. It's not going to do a lot of damage, though. I mean, considering these opponents are much weaker than normal, the flower is just there to be a flamethrower. You know, just like it was in Super Mario Brothers. I just get rid of it with R and use my sword. Well, it's not really my sword, it's really a Jedi sword. Even though I don't think this game ref gives it a reference to Star Wars or any way. Here, I'll give you a headbutt. Okay, that was pretty good. Alright, now I gotta take on Fox. Star Fox, of course. Duh. Okay, Fox is not a big deal. His real problem is the shield that he uses. And he also has a blaster for long range. Gee up and spit you out. Come on. Come on, get up back. I dare ya. Alright, this is very easy mode, so he wasn't going to be doing like up and B to get back. Don't worry, on easy and probably beyond, you'll get a little bit tougher. 
Okay, now this is where you test your wits. You have to go break targets. You can use your special moves, too. In fact, it's highly recommend you do use your special moves. Let's see. Uh, I think like a weak egg over here. There we go. Got one more. Uh, too bad I couldn't reach it from over there. Mm, which egg should I go for first? Let's see. Whoops, bad idea. That's okay, I'll just try again later. No worries. And I don't want to read any comments, oh, you should have done it like this, I mean... Who the hell cares? It's a game! Besides, it's not like it's a point of no return. Oh, I guess I gotta take out Luigi. He's not normally available, you have to unlock him. But don't worry, we'll do that later. Partner is Donkey Kong. Now this is subject to change. It's not always going to be Donkey Kong for this. Oh, both Mario Brothers failed. I get cheap shot because I kept using the same move over and over. I gotta take on Pikachu this time. Ah, uh, Silph Co. So I must be in Saffron City. Watch out when that door opens, because a random Pokemon's gonna pop up. Like Charmander just did, for instance. Damn it. Okay, no combos. Heh, <laughs> to my random pose. Up, oh, your quick attack just failed. And I get a fighter stance bonus. Oh, okay, gotta take on giant Donkey Kong this time. Three on one. Huh, and I get a normal sized Donkey Kong as an ally. How ironic. Donkey Kong's gonna have to beat himself. Now, since he's bigger, he can obviously take a lot more hits easily. But he can also hurt you. Ooh, hard for someone who wants it. Well, I don't. So I'm good. Uh, can I actually eat him? Let's see. I guess we'll never know. It'll probably look pretty funny if you did, could. Lord, board the platforms this time. Okay, so each character has their own different version of each bonus stage. Just because you're doing this one as Yoshi doesn't mean you will for other characters. I'm gonna wait... Now. Uh-oh. Oh, I oh, thought I could never recover in time. Apparently I could. One more. There, got that one. Perfect 10 out of 10. Ah, oh, the Kirby team. So really, it's just a standard Kirby with different copy versions of characters. Which Kirby can do? He can copy his opponent to use its own moves. Though it can only use like one move of a certain character. Like, 
moves he can use, well, I'll probably show you once I get Kirby himself. Or use a run as him. Ooh, a fan from Super Mario RPG! Clever throw. I don't like the fans, I'll just throw it. Oh no, a Yoshi version of me! Hey, stop it! I'm trying to get up! Oh, the bumper, gotta be careful with that. The Prime won't do too much to me. Just don't want to be put in a bad spot. There we go, nice counter. Oh, good. Definitely could have used that. Regular Kirby, spit you out. Oh, so far I haven't lost a single life. Oh, I gotta take on Samus this time. And Brinstar. Alright, let's go. Aw, we got away for now. You, but when I look at part of the background, it kind of reminds me of a map. The way it's all angled and stuff. Oh, she still got that charge attack. Oh, into the acid. A pill. Ooh, Pokeball, I choose you. Come on, get up. Blastoise didn't kill you, the acid would. So I win. Okay, take on regular Mario, but it's a metal form. So in other words, I won't be able to knock him around as much. My ass! Just imagine if I actually shot him out. Okay, now my ass hurts. Luckily, he's much heavier. Won't be able to recover so easily. Come on. Uh, yeah, that box could have been dangerous if it blew up. Oh, I couldn't make it. So sad. Too bad. Bye bye. Okay, now I gotta race to the finish and deal with some fighting polygons. They don't matter much. It's really the traps you gotta watch out for. Okay, almost there. I'm gonna make it! I'm gonna make it! 33 seconds! Ugh, now I gotta take on 30 fighting polygons. In melee, they were wireframes, and in brawl, they were. What were they again? They were like multiple colors. No, they weren't called wireframes or fighting polygons. They're really like versions of other characters. I mean, look at that one. That's obviously so Donkey Kong. There you go. Use the force, Yoshi. Take that. Yeah, don't worry, the next character run I use will be on easy mode. Not very easy, just regular easy. Just keep scaling it up now and then. I don't know if I go the route of hard or very hard, though. Maybe hard, but not too much higher than that. 
Don't worry, I've played this game before and I know how to unlock the characters. So you don't have to worry about that. Then again, if you're worried about that, you take video games way too seriously. That's all that most people do. Well, I was the same way when I was young. But I grew out of it. Sorry anymore. Oh, you're still alive? Oh, we can't have that. Oh, doing the epic pose. 666, that's funny. Okay, so this is the final boss of arcade mode, Master Hand. Let's go. This time it's just stamina mode. Master hand, anyway. Good. He's got like a whole baby attacks, though. Some of them are they're very easy to dodge. You just have to make sure you try to take a break from attacking them now and then. Ah. Jump high enough in time. Uh, is you not attack again? Like, that's so old. Do something else. There we go. Use a flutter kick. Got him. Only took 16% of damage. That's how it's done. Okay, so that, that was pretty good. 948,000 points. Whose house is this? There you see the credits. And I can press start to like, speed them up. If you really didn't care to see the credits, you can press start to like put them back to normal. Congratulations! I know. Ah, so a new challenger approaches. Captain Falcon from F Zero. Yep, he's got the standard Falcon Kick and Falcon Punch in this. Oh, crap. Yeah, usually the uh, new challenges are a bit tougher than the standard ones. Yeah, I might want to get up now. I'm gonna get him with the acid. If you beat him, you unlock him for good. Hey, come back here. Oh, there we go. The acid did most of the work. Now I can use Captain Falcon anytime I want for pretty much anything I want. Okay, I'm going to stop the video right here, and next part I'll do a run as a different character. See ya, everyone.